Hey, good morning and welcome to Oaklawn Baptist Church. I want to thank you so much for taking the time to come and worship with us today. I'm so excited to see what God is going to do in our worship today. I'm excited to see what he is going to do through the preaching of his word. If you're our guest today, I want to thank you so much for coming to be with us today. In the pew in front of you is a guest information card. If you wouldn't mind taking time to fill that out for us, we certainly would appreciate it. It'll give us a record of your visit. You can place it in the offering plate in just a few minutes, or you can bring it to the Welcome Center at the end of the service, and we'll have a free gift for you. Looking forward to an exciting worship time today. I'm so pumped about what God did this past week at our Renew Conference with Eric Capace. Thank all of you who were able to make it this week. I really appreciate that. I'm looking forward to seeing what God is going to do uh, from those messages that Eric preached this past week. Looking forward to a wonderful time today. Again, thanks for being here, and God bless you. Hey, let me take just a minute to just remind our college and career students, our students 18 out of high school and adults in your 20s, tonight is an exciting night. We are beginning our brand new college and career small group study with Jake Aton, and that's going to be in the education building tonight at five o'clock. So don't miss it, plan to come, be a part of this exciting small group. We're praying that God will grow this thing into an incredible ministry to reach college students and adults, young adults in their 20s. So make plans to come, support Jake, be there at five o'clock tonight. It's going to be an exciting time. Again, tonight, new college and career ministry kicking off, 5 p.m. in the education building with Jake. It's going to be an exciting time. Thanks so much, and looking forward to seeing what God is going to do through this new ministry. Hey, two things right quick. Number one, this coming Saturday is our youth yard sale. So, if you've got any stuff that you want to donate, bring it this week. And really, we need it before Wednesday night because we're going to be doing our final pricing uh, Wednesday night with the kids. So, we need your help. We need you to make donations. Uh, just We don't need clothes, okay? We've mentioned that. Don't bring clothing. But anything else you got, again, uh, one man's trash is another man's treasure. So, help us out. And then come and support us next Saturday around 7 a.m. Uh, till noon or so. We'll be out there trying to uh, raise funds to go to camp this summer. And of course, uh, all the proceeds go to help our students getting to Fort Bluff Camp. All right, second, <clears throat> if very important, this is the sign-up sheet. See me see it? For Operation In As Much. And Operation In As Much is May the 21st. And this is the day where we just uh, bombard our community uh, with service and so there's several opportunities for you to be able to serve on Saturday May the 21st I think last year last spring we had an incredible turnout of almost a hundred people maybe over a hundred people so we want the same kind of excitement the same kind of turnout so we'll have the food pantry you can serve that day we'll have a hospice team um, we're going to have you know, ICU care bags long care for the elderly We'll have a prayer team. We're gonna be doing lunches for the homeless. Uh, we, need, we need people for breakfast team. So right now, look, right now we've only got about 12 people signed up. So this sheet is in the foyer. Sign up today, Operation In As Much. This is quite possibly one of the most important things that we do, and that is being the hands and feet of Christ in this community. So we preach, we preach that we should love as Jesus teaches us to love, so let's do that by signing up for operation in as much. Hey, let's worship this morning. I'm looking forward to that. Stand together with me this morning and let's lift our voices to the King of Kings. Man, I'm looking forward to what God is going to do today through our worship and through his word. Thank you so much. 